Now we want to see another question where we involve uh, right issues. Because right issue is basically issued to the existing shareholders and issued at below the market price to see how the right issue will affect the earning per share. Basic earning for 2019 is 1.8 per share. Income for the year 2020, 230,000. So, the earning of the year is given to you that you have to adjust the right issue in the last year. Exactly the last year, 2019, you The company had 100,000 shares in issue. Currently, 100,000. On 1st July 2020, makes one for five right issue. Company ne har paanch ordinary share ke badle mein ek right share issue kiya. Ye right ke baare mein yu samajh le ke ye ek preemptive right hota hai. Ke aap agar market mein apne naya share lana chate hain, to pehle aap offer karenge existing shareholders ko. Existing shareholders tabhi aapke share right share kharidega jab aap unko thura sa incentive dehen ke market se below price par dehenge. Otherwise, the market is not going to be able to do it. So, right, at a price of 1 rupee, the market price of the last day of the quotation was 1.6. Then, the market is going to be able to do it. 1.6 per. And if you have offer it, it is going So, obviously, they will prefer to buy the share. And you cannot sell this right share to the outsider. No, right share means to the existing shareholder. Requirement is to calculate. The earning per share. So look here, if there are right issue, additional calculation is required and which is called theoretical x right price. It means that right se pehle aapke share ki price kya thi aur right issue nu hone ke baad aapki price kya nikalti hai. Why we call it theoretical? Because practically to different hogi market mein stock exchange mein kis baav bhi kara share ho nahi. Humne theoretically dekhna hai ki humare share ki Theoretical price क्या निकलती है? तो इसकी simple calculation है, लेकिन पांच share के बदले में एक right share। तो market price है 1.6, तो पांच की market price बन जाएगी eight rupees। और जो right share आपने issue किया है, एक एक share एक रुपए का, तो वो बना एक रुपए। तो total मिल गए nine rupees। और share कितने हो गए? छः। तो आपकी theoretical x right price बनी 1.5। तो Fraction right issue बनता है 1.5 over 1.6. आप इसको number में भी ले सकते हैं और ऐसे भी ठीक सकते हैं. Now the fractions to be used to adjust the comparative earning per share. See, look here. After uh, initially you got hundred thousand, then you have the right issue of two hundred twenty thousand. Total comes to one twenty thousand. Then weighted average number because initially. Uh, you have 100,000 but after 3 months, in yani, uh, April, you have issued it. So, in 3 months, you have to pay 1,000 But the rest of 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 और पिछले जो साल की अर्निंग थी 1.8 उसको फ्रैक्शन करेंगे तो 1.6875 और फ्रैक्शन से भी निकाल लें तो अराउंड 1.7 तो दिस इज हाउ द राइट इशू इफेक्ट्स द अर्निंग पर शेयर यूजुअली इट रिड्यूसेस थैंक यू वेरी मच